Before there was Luis Figo, and before there was Cristiano Ronaldo, the great footballing country of Portugal idolized a player with a lethal right foot strike. His name was Eusebio da Silva Ferreira, and they called him the Black Panther. He carved himself an incredible career for Benfica FC in the Portuguese league, and came close to winning a World Cup for Portugal in 1966. When he died in 2014, huge crowds lined the streets of Lisbon for a funeral procession that wound its way past the statue built in his honor at Estad de Luz, headquarters of the mighty Benfica club. The president of Portugal declared an official three days of mourning. He left a huge mark on the game of football, became the leading scorer in the history of the famous Lisbon club, and his nine goals for Portugal made him the golden boot winner at the 1966 FIFA World Cup in England, when Portugal fell just short of the final. His two goals helped Benfica to a victory in the 1962 European Cup, forerunner of today's Champions League, with a 5-3 result over Real Madrid in Amsterdam, the second of the club's consecutive triumphs in Europe. Benfica came from 2-0 down after the great Ferenc Puskas scored twice early for Real, and ultimately Eusebio's brace was enough to deny the Spanish club. The Lisbon club won eight Primeira Liga titles in the 1960s and three League Cups, as well as the two European triumphs, ranking at first among European clubs three times in 1965, 1966, and 1969. With his thunderous right foot strikes, Eusebio was at the heart of it. And in 15 seasons at Benfica, he would win 11 Portuguese titles.